Okay, we're gonna put together a real simple dinner, or you could use, uh, yeah. this would be a good breakfast. Uh, I normally eat it about dinner time. It's real easy. It's just basically eggs and tomatoes. And we're gonna throw a little green onion in here. I've got two green onion. I've cut the roots off and kind of cleaned up a little bit. Remember, you gotta kind of clean everything off. You don't want anything dirty going into your dishes. That, and that applies whether you're stir frying or cooking or whatever. So we're just gonna take these green onions, cut them up, cut them up pretty fine. Now we're gonna be using stir fry oil, and our stir fry oil already has some green onion flavor. But we're gonna want some nice fresh green onion or spring onion, scallion. Remember we had that conversation a while back. People from different places call it different things. Now we're not gonna use all of this, but uh We'll, set, we'll just, what we don't use, we'll set aside and we'll use another time. Like maybe tomorrow night. Doesn't hurt to, while you're prepping stuff, go ahead and prep a little extra. And you can put it in little bowls and save it. Now what we'll do, push that over to the side. Now one thing you gotta do when you stir frying, you have to have everything ready and in place before you ever start cooking because if you don't whenever things get going you ain't gonna have time now we're not dicing these up too small kind of a rough dice I guess you could call it and I'm gonna do two I'm gonna do two of these tomatoes anyway I'll be back with you here in a minute okay so now I'm, I've got my eggs. I'm using brown eggs. These are cage-free, all tutti fruity. You, whatever eggs you got, use those. These are large eggs, but really size doesn't matter too much. I mean, it's kind of a ratio. I'm going two eggs, two Roma tomatoes. Now I crack my eggs in the different bowls. Reason being, if I get shells in this bowl, it's easier to take it out if I only have one egg. So now I'm gonna put that in there. And so if you're doing larger, you know, you're doing three or four eggs, you don't want to put a bad egg in, in your bowl and you have to ruin the whole deal. It's a good habit to get into. Anyway, we'll be back. Okay, so now I'm going to turn this heat up. I've had my wok sitting here on a low temperature and I'm going to turn it up, let it start warming up a little better. And now's a good time to go over and make sure I have all my ingredients. I've got my eggs, I've got my oil, my salt, tomatoes green onion and over here I have a plate that I'm a clean plate that I'm going to be putting everything on when we get done so what we're going to do now we're going to take whip our eggs up because we're getting pretty close to being ready to go to go to work here Heat up just a little more. Now we're gonna get ready to stir fry. Be right back. Okay, my wok's getting warm. We're gonna put some of our stir fry oil in. We made that the other night. Swirl this around, make sure our pan gets coated. We need to get a little more heat in here. We're just about there, not quite there. We don't need to be screaming hot for this. And all we're going to do is we're making some scrambled eggs right now. Put them in the sink. There we go. I'm not going to take 
these out for now. We're not done, quite done cooking these. We're gonna take them out for the moment. Come on, there we go. Now, most of those are out. I'll put just a little bit more oil in here. Give it another swirl. And we're gonna turn this all the way up on high now. I'm gonna need just a little bit more oil. Turn around the edges a little bit. There we go. Now we're gonna put some of our green onion in there. We'll put our tomato down. We're gonna hit this with a little bit of salt all to help break the tomatoes down just a little bit, but we don't want to cook them the most. All we're really doing with these tomatoes is just kind of heating them through a little bit. We're gonna put our eggs back in. Just kinda stir that around. We're gonna turn it off. It's done. We're gonna plate this up and we'll give it a taste. Okay, so this is a real easy one. I know you guys can cook this. It's delicious, looks good. Easy, come on guys, take it. Try, give it a try. And then whenever you cook it, be sure to send me a picture. I'll put a link down below for my email address. Anyway, let's give this a try. Yeah, there we go. Mm. It's good, you can Hints of the ginger and garlic from the stir fry oil, plenty of green onion, you got a little bit of tomato there, and eggs. I love eggs, so it's delicious. I love it. Give it a try, please.